Hi, I'm Dawn with Drucker Diagnostics, and today we're going to spin our first samples in the Horizon 12. Your first spin in the Horizon 12. Your Horizon 12 is set up, and now we're ready for our first spin. Before we can spin a cycle, we need to make sure that the centrifuge is correctly loaded. That means that samples it will spin are balanced. Like any centrifuge, the Horizon 12 should always be run with a balanced load. This helps keep the lab safe and ensures the maximum lifespan for your centrifuge. Step one, make sure that all 12 tube holders are properly seated in the Horizon 12 rotor. They do not snap into place, but should be seated one per slot in the rotor. Step two, load your samples. When loading your samples, opposing tube holders must be of equal weight, as shown in the diagram on your screen. So if we're loading two tubes, put them across from each other. If it's three, make a triangle, four, a square, and so on. If you're spinning an odd number of tubes, you'll need a counterbalance tube. First, figure out which of your tubes needs the counterbalance. It'll be the one without a balance tube across from it. Then, get an empty tube of identical size and volume and fill it with water. The counterbalance should be roughly the same weight as your filled tube. Then, place it across from its partner tube. With your tube holders in place and your samples loaded and balanced, you're ready to spin. With the lid open, use the stop unlock button to select your desired cycle. In our case, we're going to run cycle one. This cycle has a factory default of 10 minutes at 3600 RPM, which is 1800 XG. The other default presets are listed on your screen now for easy reference. Keep in mind, these can be customized to your lab's preferred spins if desired, but this is what will be programmed into the Horizon 12 when it arrives from the factory. With your desired cycle selected, Close the lid. Secure the lid latch by pressing it down gently and turning it a quarter turn clockwise. Press the start button. The centrifuge will automatically lock and the rotor will begin to spin, accelerating until it reaches the cycle's RPM. It will then run for the cycle's programmed time. Once the run is complete, the centrifuge will begin to slow down. When the rotor is fully stopped, the centrifuge will beep and the lid lights will flash to let you know it's done. The centrifuge will automatically unlock. Turn the lid latch a quarter turn counterclockwise and then lift the lid to retrieve your spun samples. And that's all there is to it. If you have any other questions about your Horizon 12, you can always contact Drucker Diagnostics and we'll be happy to help. Thanks for watching and have a great day.